humans, and welcome to the beautiful Mall of Royalia. Okay, <laughs> we're not at a mall, but do these not give you major mall escalator vibes? Just saying. But I am holding this microphone because I have some very important news for all of you. Do you guys realize that it is October tomorrow? Okay, I hope you guys have been saving up your diamonds because we're gonna talk about all of the things that are coming back on sale and all of the things that you should be saving up for in October. So Lancelot has confirmed that the Shadow Empress set will be here on October 1st. But I saw some questions about this. What about the time zone? Is if you do live in a different time zone than Barbie and Lance's, which is Pacific time, it should come out late night on September 30th. That is tonight. Tonight, the Shadow Empress set is supposed to come back out. Also, I don't know, I don't know what these Adobe hashtags are. So you guys can see here, look at this Shadow Empress. Okay, so this is officially sold in October. And you guys, as of tonight, if if you have enough diamonds, you will be able to purchase it. So I just did the math. And in total, this will cost you 123,000 diamonds to get the entire Shadow Empress set. actually has done a royal high in real life and look at this so they were working on this back in august and they were working on making the shadow empress set and this is their progress as of this month and look at how cute it's turning out i cannot wait to see what this looks like when it's all done so the shadow empress set is obviously the number one thing that i think you guys should save up for in october there's so many beautiful details and i love the long nails and i also think the shape of the body is very realistic she is thick and we are here for this and i've also paired it with the number one halloween accessory i think you need to buy in october For those of you who are not familiar, you can go ahead and search the seasonal items in the shop and there is a Halloween tag. And you can see right here, this magical witch hat is going to be available in October. Now we are not sure how much it's going to be because currently it is showing last year's prices from the candy hunt, but we'll definitely keep you posted if we get any news. And I also think that the vampire crown looks incredible with this set. So this is my number two item that I think you guys should save up for. I mean, this crown is completely iconic and it has the bat wings. As we saw, bats were very popular in the Halloween concepts this year. I think it's a good idea to stock up on all of the bat things that you can buy. And this is called the vampire crown. And it was passed down from the most infamous vampire royalty family. And this was more expensive than the magical witch hat. This one was 2,500 candies. So even though we don't know the exact price in diamonds yet, or if they're gonna have some sort of candy currency, you guys, at least you know, this one's gonna be a little bit more expensive. And guys, I just wanna point out that LL Comics has actually made this vampire crown in real life and did such a freaking amazing job. So LL Comics actually has an entire vampire Empire crown tutorial DIY. I will leave a link to that in the description if you guys want to remake some of this Halloween stuff in real life. And you guys, the video is amazing. Definitely go check it out. Peekaboo! I had to show off one of my favorite OG accessories that I am very excited to announce will be back on sale in October. And these are called the Nocturnal Kitty Ears. So I think one of the coolest things about these is that they actually glow and they do also kind of look like the kitty headphones that a lot of YouTubers use. So it could also work for a lot of really cool cosplays, which is another reason why you should definitely buy these in October. Now these cost a total of 10,000 candy. Again, significantly more expensive than the witch hat and the vampire crown. So if you are interested in getting these adorable little accessories, you want glowing little cat ears on your head, I definitely would save up some diamonds, okay? Let's try to just convert candy to diamonds and maybe try to save up that much. Now this next item is no stranger to controversy. 
Okay, so this is the kitty crossbody bag and it is a kawaii adorable kitty cat. But I saw some drama come out because somebody took a closer look at this kitty cat and somebody discovered that the kitty cat looks like two seashells <laughs> from Royal High stuck together. So we're gonna go to the beach and try to see if that looks similar and see if it's true. And I do think that this bag does look really cute with the kitty ears and I just think it's such an important part of royal history that we need to respect it. Okay, we're gonna go look for a shell in the sea during the tsunami. Hello, is there any money for me? Hello? Okay, we're going to Sunset Island. More shells. So guys, I came to Sunset Island to look at this shells guide. Is this a conspiracy? It looks like one with all these weird flaming lanterns next to us. But uh, aside from the ridges in the top, I'm kind of starting to see the seashell shape. Doesn't matter, I still I still love this purse. But Cyber, what about all those little spooky sisters who, who don't have any candy or diamonds this Halloween, but, but still want to set? All right, so I'm sure a lot of you guys, the Shadow Empress, you might not have enough diamonds for, but I have a really great idea of how you could kind of fake looking like you have a Halloween set, okay? This is going to be spoopy on a sister spoopy budget. And uh, this is one thing that is only sold in October. So as you can see here in the shop for 3,500 candies. So a little bit more expensive than the witch and vampire ground a little less expensive than the kitty bag. But these gothic Lolita sleeves can actually kind of give you the effect of having a set without having a set. And look at the effect of this. So as you can see here, I put on these spoopy little sleeves and I think they actually look really, really incredible here when you pair it with one of the cheaper skirts in the shop. So I paired it with the pleated skirt, which is 5,500 diamonds, which is just a little bit cheaper than the Shadow Empress, which is 28,000 diamonds. I was trying to find a good animation to show this off, but just, oh gosh. But I think this does make a pretty cute budget set, if you know what I mean. So guys, definitely keep this in mind. If you don't farm as many diamonds as you think, you still have options for fashion. Fashion! Now we gotta talk about shoes. I think one of the most popular pairs of shoes I get asked to trade for these all the time. These are the Batmo heels and these will be sold in October, but you are really gonna need to farm some diamonds. So these cost 33,000 diamonds. So again, this is another great option if you can't afford the entire Shadow Empress set. You definitely could look into the Batmo heels. But I think one of the things that I love most about these shoes is that it doesn't actually change the shape of your character's leg. As you can see here, it goes right over whatever existing clothing you're wearing. So let's say there's a clothing designer and they have some touches like these adorable socks on Kitzilla's Halloween clown outfit. And maybe you don't wanna hide those with a new leg shape. These are absolutely perfect for that and they are so adorable so definitely keep this in mind these are definitely one of the older items but I think they're still a really great item for Halloween now something I noticed is that day of the dead in 2020 in the United States actually starts on Halloween this year and ends on Monday November 2nd and now I'm back in my conspiracy room for this because I noticed something weird in the shop so we do actually have day of the dead accessories but these aren't gonna be sold in until November. So sorry guys, you won't be able to celebrate Day of the Dead on the day that it starts, but hopefully you'll be so busy with Halloween that you won't notice. But anyways, I just thought for those of you that celebrate Day of the Dead or were interested in those accessories, those will be coming back. So you will get to celebrate on the last two days. I hope you guys found this video helpful. I know I kind of forget what stuff is coming back and when it's gonna be on sale and also how much it is. So I wanted to save you guys money. Oh gosh, what's happening? Oh, oh, this thing won't stop. I hope you found this helpful. Let me know if you guys would like me to do more videos like this to keep you guys updated on stuff that is coming back into the shop in its own individual video focus on all of the fashion but thank you guys for watching i hope you guys get a chance to get some of these amazing items good luck saving up diamonds and i'll see you in the update humans goodbye